Hello, my name is Tom Morgan. I work in sculpture. Uh, what you see is uh, sculptures based off the human condition. I try to create sculptures that uh, usually the viewer, the consumer don't know that they, they relate to it. I mean, because they're part of the sculpture and they don't even know it until they start looking at it and reading it. I use imagery that people are familiar with. Windows, keys. Windows symbolize uh, um, searching for something and the stones are usually um, representing something in their life that weighs on them or shows the signs of difficulty that they're dealing with. Uh, but then I just juxtapose all those images um, to create stories that they can relate to. Usually it's like finding yourself, decision making, um, you know, the burdens of life, things like that. So start to finish, it starts off, usually either I get a vision of something, but a lot of, a lot of it starts with little stories that I write, things that I talk about, like I'm, I'm feeling or um, drawings. Images pop in my head and then I decipher them. So I didn't realize it was like um, relating to things that I deal with and that other people deal with the same things as they go through life. So it was just like, it just made sense to start making work that wasn't just eye candy. So as a sculptor, it's like most sculptors take and, and sculpt a clay figure and then they pull a master and then they do that on like 20 times. I didn't want to be repetitious that way, um, as in creating the same thing like that. Uh, what I do is I create components, like I create, I sculpt feet, hands, little, little parts of the human body, and then I put them together like, um, like a tinker toy or like, uh, like Lego sets, the kind of things you played with in your child. And then it ended up made almost like a Lego set out of human anatomy. And then I just look at my drawings and then that kind of, I build it right in metal right away. So it's like, that would be the only one. I'll make similar versions. Um, but usually each piece is like unique. Well, St. Louis is a great art fair. I mean, usually I like that fair because it's like, there's a lot of really good artists there and, and everybody is, is kind of like excited to go because you, and every year I've gone, it's like I've learned, I've seen things that I haven't seen before. And it's always nice to see things that inspire another artist. Not really in the same kind of media or, or visual style, but it's like the uniqueness inspires other people to say, hey, I want to do something unique too, or I want to, I want to go beyond what I've been doing or something like that.